Acupuncture Party Tricks Part 6, Nasal and Sinus Congestion. Hi, I'm David Herbologic. I've been an acupuncturist for about 20 years, and I like to share some of the things that I've learned that can help people with some minor issues. Today, I'd like to talk about nasal and sinus congestion. Here's the thing, though, is let me show you where these points are. You can press on them. It's going to help. But the thing is, is that as soon as you stop pressing on them, it goes right back to normal. But let me show you where they are, and then let me tell you why I think there is a use case for that where it's not big, uh, not a really big problem. All right, for the nose... Follow this little groove right here, all the way up to where it meets your nose. That's your point. Get some good firm pressure on there, move it around, and you will, and a lot of times your nose will just clear up. You can get a good deep breath, and then you take it away, and it goes stuffy again. For the other point, it's going to be right to right under your right about right under your pupil when you're looking forward. Kind of feel for a divot in there, and then hold some pressure on there, and you should feel your sinuses release, and then unrelease. But here's the thing: is and this is when it has helped me out. When you have some sort of sinus congestion, it just, it's a fullness, right? It's not a big issue until you get on the airplane. And then the airplane starts climbing. And then the pressure in there won't release and it causes a lot of pain. And a lot of times if you can just get in there and let it release a little bit just to equalize that pressure, it can get rid of that pain almost immediately. All right, if you want more tips like this, hit the plus sign. See you in the next video. Thanks.